All right, thanks for tuning in to Kerr Outdoors. Hey, I just got back from a rabbit hunting trip where I took this out, um, and I wanted to do a quick review on this Heritage Arms uh, 22 pistol. Now, I, I've had this 22 pistol for a little bit of time, and I've got to put it through its paces. You know, I've uh, really enjoyed having this thing. Um, and this is just, and I've gone ahead, just so you know, and, and I've uh, made sure that this is unloaded and safe. Uh, and so I just wanted to show you this really quick because I think these are a pretty great value. Um, now this is uh, kind of neat because it uh, is a 22 long rifle, but it also comes with an extra cylinder that you can use for a 22 uh, Magnum as well. Or it can if you go ahead and, and get the updated version. And if you just purchase it with just the regular uh, 22 long rifle cylinder, you can actually order a separate uh, cylinder later that's capable of holding a 22 Magnum cartridge um, from Heritage Arms. Anyway, just to take a look at this, this is a single action revolver, which means when you shoot it, basically you've got to pull the hammer back before you go ahead and shoot it. Uh, which I really like because I found that that just really increases the accuracy of this firearm. Um, and I found this to be actually fairly accurate. And I've taken a number of rabbits out rabbit hunting with this thing, and I found it to be just super effective and fun to shoot. Um, to go ahead and load this thing, you've got a little door there where you'd pull that open and insert your rounds. You can see that's empty. Um, it's got wood handles. Uh, the metal, I'm not sure what kind of metal it is, but for the price I can't imagine the metal is anything too too special. It's got a metal trigger and a trigger guard as well. And uh, the one thing on it that I thought was a little bit iffy is this extractor and how this works is if you were going to um, if you were going to unload this, you push this extractor and it sends a rod up through the uh, through the chamber there and will push out your spent shell casing. Um, but this, this little lever uh, for the extractor is actually made of plastic. And in my opinion, that's probably the one of the cons to this little model um, is the fact that this little piece here is made of plastic. Everything else seems to be made of metal of some sort or you know the wood grips. Uh, the other thing that I had happen with this is um, after using it for a time, I found that some of these screws started to work their way loose. So I had to go through and just tighten all the screws, which, uh, you know, wasn't a big deal. But if I hadn't noticed, it could have been something that um, was detrimental because I could have lost something important. I think this screw right here is something that came loose and I had to retighten that. Um, but all in all, I've really enjoyed this little pistol from Heritage Arms. And uh, I think it's uh, a great value. Uh, now, one thing I hear commented about this a lot that, that a lot of people don't like, which actually I kind of do like, is the fact that this has a safety. And you can see the safety is right here. It's this lever. And it's in the on position right now, so the safety is on. To take the safety off, you just flip that down. You can kind of see that there. Now the safety is off. And safety is on. So it's a little bit different than many revolvers because a lot of revolvers don't have this little safety off to the side. And so I've, I've heard some other reviews where people think that's a negative feature. I actually really like that because I think it's just a, a great extra measure. And I really like the fact that this is a single action revolver. Um, and uh, so all in all, pretty great. So just uh, as far as this review goes, I think that the uh, pros for this I think the pros for this definitely outweighs the cons, and I've just found this to be a great little pistol and well worth having. You know, and something like this is just kind of, not only is it fun and inexpensive to go ahead and get some range time with, but, uh, you know, a lot of times if I'm out hunting and I have uh, my big old hunting rifle with me, I don't want to, uh, you know, use that to shoot a rabbit if I come across a rabbit. So just kind of a useful little tool to have with you. So there you have it. Uh, if you like our channel, please go ahead and consider subscribing and drop a like and leave a comment. Have a great day and be safe.